Hey guys, welcome back to the bench. Hambo here for the third and final part of some of my flashlight collection. Like I said, I have these in all the packs uh, I carry all over the place. I'm going to go to that one last. This is kind of unusual. Again, you remember the Streamlight one I had, the Sidewinder, that uh, switches over and allows you to clip on. It is kind of big and bulky. It is extraordinarily rugged. It is a military issue, military grade uh, flashlight. This one is too, but it's much smaller. This is called the Pentagon light, uh, in part because they have their little trademark symbol right there in the shape of the Pentagon around the on-off switch. This reminds me of the old Boy Scout flashlights. It's a 90 degree light. It is a single, fairly bright LED, but this thing is totally bomb-proof. Drop it flood it. Throw it in the bottom of the pool. It'll still work. Uh, it's got a very strong and unique shaped clip that will go on everything from other pieces of gear to web gear to your hat to anything. I've actually used this on baseball caps when I can't find one of those stupid little cap lights. I'll pop it on the baseball cap and it'll shine down on what I'm doing. It works very well. The other cool thing about this is it has interchangeable lenses. Uh, they come with four lenses. You can put I'm sorry to shake that a little bit. You can put your lens of choice in the bottom here and it screws on. I'm try not to hit the table. Screws on to the front and gives you the color. But the thing about this is the colored lens attenuates the light a lot. It really dims it down. But it does give you that option. And also in the bottom, almost useless, but there is a small contact magnetic base compass which kind of defeats the purpose of the compass but I guess maybe they had to put something to cover the hole <laughs> so you have a little compass in there but uh, I wouldn't want to try to navigate my way out of anything with that but anyway that uh, that does really well um, this is really interesting and I may do another video on this because I have a 12 volt source this is by a company called Nebo I've started using a bunch of their flashlights in various situations just because they're very affordable and they're very durable. This is a cigarette lighter light. It's designed, it has a rechargeable battery. You throw it one way, and I think I will do another video on this to show you. I've got 12 volt sockets here. You plug it in, this glows bright red to show you that it's charging. Uh, it can literally live in there. It, it has a circuit in here that it literally turns the charge off once the battery is fully up so you don't burn the battery out. And that LED will stay lit. Kind of a neat little effect if you're leaving your car overnight somewhere. It does not affect your battery. Very, very minimal current draw. And it's a very, very bright light. Um, it's just really handy to have sitting in the car in the cigarette lighter if you're not using it for anything else. It's kind of a neat little accessory. Uh, it goes well in a pocket, in a purse and a pouch anywhere and it's just a really nice little very bright light and it's called the uh, Nebo High Beam and it actually is pretty cool I thought uh, that was neat these are uh, eight bucks you can get them on eBay for even less than that but uh, that's good and then this is the one I've been using a lot in the field recently this is traveling in the main gear bag uh, again it's by Nebo it's called the Nebo Red Line uh, this is no cheapy. I mean, it's only 30 bucks, but it is brilliantly built. It is bright as hell. I mean, <laughs> I can light up the other side of the room so that people can read with this flashlight. Now, it's spotted. It is focusable, so you can flood it out or bring the spot back in and the cool thing is at flood it still maintains a high degree of brightness as you can see sorry about shaking the camera um, and as a defensive light you're gonna burn somebody's retinas out with this thing very cool little effect that is a thirty dollar flashlight that it's worth its weight in gold look at the lens on that thing it's just it's an amazing focus of the light energy the Nebo red line I've actually got two of these. They work very, very, very well. And finally, just for those of you that are backpackers or emergency response or anything, I know you've seen these. They're sold in all the major hardware stores. They're called uh, Light Glow, uh, Light Gear Glow Sticks. It's a multifunction thing. It uses three common watch batteries, and it's multifunctional. Of course, first of all, it's a minimal 
flashlight. Okay. Second function, lights up the LED glow, be used as a marker. Third, to save on batteries, it turns off the flashlight, gives you the solid glow. This comes in yellow, red, green, and blue. So you can pick the color you want. I know a lot of guys that are first responders that are using these as markers on their jackets and on their backpacks. Works really well. And it also has a flash function. And because they couldn't leave well enough alone, they had a cool product, but they had to make it stupid. It's got, it's got plastic on it, but if you pull this cap off, let's see. Let's see if I can get this tape off. Okay. It's got a whistle. <laughs> I don't know why. It's very loud. I apologize for that. But, yeah, it's got a whistle couldn't leave well enough alone. It's a cool design, waterproof, reliable, easy to replace the batteries. This unscrews. You have really good gaskets on here. Keeps the water out. Does a great job. Had to put the whistle on. Still haven't figured that out. Anyway, I have seen the light. Like I said, it's usually in my hand. And that's some of what I've got. The others are packed away in bags that are in various vehicles. But anyway, that's it so far. We'll see you here on the bench next time.